Hey gamers, it's Grind This Game here, back with Oxygen Not Included, the all achievement challenge where we're trying to do every achievement in one series, one playthrough. And I got a bunch of comments on the last episode, and we're gonna go through some of them right now. Uh, first thing, first thing is Radani has a hole <laughs> in it. Some sand fell down last time. We're gonna have to get that sealed right away, otherwise we're gonna lose lose oxygen, which would be bad. Oxygen will become not included if we do that. Let's get that fixed up. Do a little bit of mopping here. And this little pit. <laughs> I'm gonna have to, uh... What's growing down here? There's something growing in here. Water weed. We'll kind of push this water up and then mop it up. Or maybe we can just... I think we can just cover it up. It's probably gonna squeeze out, but we'll see what we can do there. Mop this up. I do want to get this going at some point. I'm gonna to try to focus on the job suitability one this episode. But we'll probably get distracted with other stuff as we go. Get a little pip here. Uh, we'll take him. We'll take him. Okay, then. The breach has been sealed, so that's looking a little bit better. Uh, what else was on the list? The O2 lines. Um, not sure what that means. <laughs> oh, I think I know what it meant. Uh, we're squirting oxygen into areas we don't need to right now. Like up here somewhere like this. We don't need this vent here anymore. Get rid of that. I think basically anywhere we're, we're spraying oxygen outside the core base is not really worth it. Like right here, this is... Actually, that's inside the base, so that, we want that one. Um, and then down below, we had a CO2 issue. I had these, these here temporarily. Now is a safe time to fill them in because we want to build up pressure in here. And we want to get this one going as well. Let's make sure that we got our room bonus here. Yeah, we do. Let's make sure this is set to... Horrible eggs. And we should set this to auto wrangle. It is set to seven. How many do we have in there? Seven. Perfect. Okay, so they're getting distributed. And this should get moved over here, and we're slowly sucking the oil out of here that I spilt last episode by mistake. It's getting put in here. To the petroleum line to get burnt off. I probably want to insulate uh, this layer up here. Try to keep one hot zone and one not so hot zone. We already got the abyssalite here, but it's kind of not in line with what I want. Let's just make a floor here. This is low priority. Another floor for future expansions. And we'll do the same thing here, but we're gonna insulate this floor, I think. Igneous rock, <clears throat> priority one. Get this sealed in. And we'll just build an insulating layer, I think right across here. We'll keep this area down here warm and everything above it kind of less warm. Okay, this water's kind of stuck here. I guess we'll have to dig that out. Okay, so job su suitability. We need Bulgani. We were setting up some suits to force the dupes to always wear suits except when they're uh, only wear suits or wear suits whenever they're not in their bedrooms basically. So I just need the dock for that now. The, um, actually, yeah, let's do that. That must be checkpoint right here. Lead, yeah, we'll use, we'll use iron, I guess. Could get warm here. And then anything they do outside of their sleeping area should, uh, work towards that job suitability requirement. Let's just make sure it's working. Should be no way out. 
Let's send one of them in here to test it out. Should should be fine. Now when they come out, I have to put on a suit. Perfect. Okay. Good. This is what we wanted. Uh, I'm not sure why I have an airlock here. We'll get rid of that. So everyone should eventually get a suit on here. Now we've got to do the same thing in Red Annie. <clears throat> we need suits right outside the bedroom. Now we have kind of a weird bedroom set up here. And no room for suits. So I might move the bedrooms. We could put the bedrooms back here a little bit more. How's the temperature? Pretty good back here. I don't think we can build tiles over this. Because we got background tiles there, unfortunately. Uh, but if we put the bedroom kind of back a little bit here, and then put the suits in front of it, I think that will work nicely. I just have to temporarily move, like change these up. Too bad they can't quickly replace them. Guess we'll do one at a time here, very carefully. So we don't lose too much oxygen to the uh, exterior here. I guess we could build tiles around it, but we'll just quickly pop a tile in there before we vent too much oxygen. make this one an emergency. Okay, we're just gonna do, quickly do this. Quickly get this out of the way. Man, we can't do uh, background buildings like that. Okay, we'll try this like this. that gets sealed. Seal the breach. Okay. Good. Let's tear down this. Well, we'll get the next bedroom ready first. Let's open this up. This thing is kind of in the way. We got kind of an odd floor here going on, so we're gonna... Remove this for now. And I think these guys are stuck, so we're gonna open these tiles up. Oops, don't need to have the emergency anymore. I guess this wood is growing even though it's kind of covered. This will fr free them up a little bit. Get this out of the way. Random, random hatches and stuff running around. Okay, radiation. Let's just make sure no one's getting irradiated here. I think we're good. We got natural gas kind of collecting here. Let's clean up the rest of this. And our food is running low, and there's a reason for that. But first, the reason this thing wasn't working, this, these seeds are showing up because we actually have mutated seeds. But the problem is, I have my research restricted to only the researchers. We're going to change that so everyone is standard. That should allow our cook to actually do some analysis here. I think that's what was wrong. No, not our cook, our farmer, sorry. So it's, the farmer has to operate this, but they also needed access to the research. And nope, I thought that was someone doing it, but maybe not. I think someone should be along to do that. Maybe. They can find the seed. Maybe they're uh, taking their coffee break. Our fridges are filling up pretty fast. We've got a bunch of sleet wheat. Uh, 229 sleet wheat. 
Now we can turn into food. Once I analyze this seed, let's double check here that that priority got changed. Researching. Yeah, everyone's able to. Oh, Brandon, no, he's on a different planet. That doesn't matter. Try this again. I'm assuming we have mutated seeds because of this. This is making a strange sound. <laughs> Sounds like an alien calling. Okay, maybe this isn't working. <laughs> I'm going to deconstruct it and uh, rebuild it and see if we get the same result here. So something is a little, a little bit off here. We will build it again. Let's see if anything changes. Maybe the mutated seeds got cooked or fed to our pakus. I'm not really sure. Let's see if those two show up again. Yeah, they do. They do. Won't analyze. Will analyze. 39. Crucial materials for this building are beyond reach or unavailable. Yeah, why did these show up then? It's very strange. Not quite sure what's happened in there. And someone mentioned you could see the mutated seeds by clicking on one of these and somehow seeing it in here. Maybe. I mean, it says these are original. But I think they were saying somewhere you can see that there's mutated ones. Maybe we don't have any mutated ones, but I have no idea why these two in particular are showing up here. Not quite sure. Proof farming two. <clears throat> hmm. Anyway, well, hopefully we'll get some mutated seeds. I think I'll cook up the sleepweed that I do have, though. Because uh, our food is running low. Hopefully, don't, we, hopefully we don't cook the mutant seeds. But we'll turn frost buns off for now. Get all those cooked up. Maybe we can see them in the fridges here? Let's see. Sleepweed green original. Don't see any in there. We do need to build a deep freeze, I think. <laughs> These are all original, original. Hmm. What about these? I think this is all original as well. Well, we'll clear out everything we have here. I did learn some new things about the, the mutation code for the game. So if the rads are over 300, I think it is, or maybe it's 500. I think it's 300 per cycle, and we're way over that. That means the base, the base chance, if it's over 500, is 33 percent. So we should definitely be getting some uh, some mutations here. What uranium do we have? Not much left, actually. What the hell is this thing doing? Is it disintegrating our uranium? Is it moving it from here to here? <laughs> I think it is. Yeah, this should be more higher priority. Oh, it is. What the heck? <laughs> it's very strange. Um... <laughs> Okay, there we go. It's stopped. This should be feeding this. Well, hopefully we get a mutation. 
Let's go back to Red Annie and work on these suits. Okay, we're gonna build a bedroom here. Right here. A door on here. Get rid of that tile. Like there's no space exposure up here, I don't think there is. This out, clear this out. So we, we got a loud sleeper there. Let's put uh, some space for them. Two beds worth of space, and then the beds there. Tear this down. So Nisbet's the loud sleeper. We'll put Nisbet over there. I saw a mutated seed sign somewhere just a second ago. Um, radiation, radiation. Probably for them standing in here. Oh yeah, someone mentioned that this was over-engineered big time. And I totally agree. I could have just done something much simpler like um, one line for all of these. So we're going to change this up. I was overthinking it. I was trying to be fancy. But it needed to be much simpler. Just a straight... Straight across. So it's this one or this one or this one. You don't need any ore gates. Okay, and a little bit more. This one's not quite done. Okay, it should be done now. Rads are off. And I think the rads only need to be on <clears throat> when the seed is being... Oh, you know what? You know what? They're not going to be able to get in there. I think the rads need to be happening the minute they pick it. So it's almost as if we want this reversed. We only want rads being applied when they're in here. Because that means they're harvesting seeds. Hmm. I think I might just remove all the automation completely and just let them suck it up in terms of the rads for now. And that way they're guaranteed to be on when they come and uh, harvest. The other thing I should do is probably only allow the farmers in here. Because the chance of getting a mutated seed um, is based on their farming skill. So we're going to put a door here. And only allow our farmers in here. Is there no room left for that sleep meat to go anywhere? Fridges are full. I think uh, they just need to make a bunch of frost buns. They're working on it. Might need two cooks. Awesome seeds. Fine, fine. Our water's looking a little bit low. Hopefully that doesn't become a concern. Okay, we got mutations on, or radiation on all the time now. Okay, good. That might have been the problem. Because if it turned off during harvesting, then they would never have gotten a mutant. So that might be it. But let's control. Who are who are our who is our greatest um, farmer? Let's find them. Um, who is great? Um, let's see. Agriculture eleven. Six. Nine. And eleven. I guess Rene. 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 And 
Adam, we'll let in. Okay, the default is no one. But Adam, Rene will allow to go in there. High stress. What? Well, Liam's on the rocket. With his suit on. 61% stress. Where, where the heck is Liam? Oh no. Is he far away? Is he just standing in the rocket in... Where is that rocket? Florado? Well, take your suit off. So you can breathe easily. Oh, it's right here. Okay, you get home. Immediately. And hopefully we don't have a stress out on the rocket. Got a decent amount of food left. Hopefully enough to get there. Got water in the pipes. Yeah, you'll be fine, Liam. You'll be fine. Oh! Max stress. He's only at 62%. Oh, he's going up though. Hmm. How much power do we have in here? Another kilojoules. We should put a uh, massage table in here, maybe? Gonna get rid of these. Let's see if we can build a massage table. Don't know if he'll have the materials. Don't think he will. Let's see, medical. Nope. Oh, yeah, we can. We can. You make that for us. He's gonna be home soon anyway. He'll be fine. Maybe he'll be able to get on this. Calm him down a little bit. There he goes. Ah. What a lucky fellow. Okay. Back to Radani. Where I've destroyed the bedroom. Okay. Brandon, you're not supposed to be here. Nisbet's supposed to be there. size of room do we have here? 16. We're not going to fill this asteroid up. But we don't need that many suits either, so let's just seal that up. Maybe put some airflow here, actually. Oh! Mutation. We have a mutation. Except it's on the wrong planet. <laughs> um, that's unfortunate. We don't have an easy way to send that back. Fortunately. But we got a mutation, that's good. Guess we'll just close the bedroom off. We'll leave room for one more bed, maybe. And in here, we will put the suits. We need three suits, at least. Um, stations, exosuit dock, got seed analysis complete. Okay, that's good. Something happened. Sleepweed super specialized. Nice. Okay, we got one of them. Lovely, we got one of them. Okay, this door we're gonna lock only be allowed to come through here. This is going to need power. This line is already pretty saturated, but we'll allow it. This container is kind of in a weird spot. We're going to raise it up 
So it looks a bit nicer. Okay, that rocket. Is it back? No, not even close. Not even close. Okay, suits. Um, we're gonna... Oh, we still haven't figured this out here. Let's quickly build this. We're gonna put insulated tile right there. This is gonna be for the fresh water eventually coming from the salt water. Okay, Barracks is back. Nisbet's bed is back. Let's deliver some suits. And some oxygen. Oops, wrong thing to copy there. Oh, we'll, we'll do them in parallel here. Kind of. Kind of. Okay, let's check that colony achievement to see the one mutation on our list for A-OK. -okay. GMO, A-OK, -okay. we got sleet wheat done. Only this many to go. <laughs> Quite a few to go. At most suits, we have zero free units, so we're gonna have to make up some. Or we can remove these. Is it safe for them to go in here? It's only 45 degrees here. 54, 57. I think we can safely remove these. Food is running out on the rocket. Food is running out. Stress is being dealt with in a weird way. <laughs> uh, he's not probably able to pilot the rocket. Oh no, it's it's on autopilot. It'll be there in 0.9 cycles. Okay, we'll be fine. Everything is fine. See if this changed. Hmm. Oh, there's more mutations in here. Okay. Well, we can retire the sleep we know. What should we do next? Um, what could we do next? What would be a good plant to put in here? It's a little bit chilly. A little bit chilly. Um, let's just check that list here. There's some other cold plants we could do. GMA A OK. Um maybe only Nosh Sprout, actually. I think Nosh Sprouts like it cold. Let's go check Blagani. I think the Nosh Sprouts are on Blagani. They like to be in carbon dioxide and air pressure. And minus 25 to zero. So they like it a little bit cooler. And how cold is it in here? Minus four, perfect. But we need to change the atmosphere in here uh, to CO2. Which means we'll probably want a liquid lock to forcibly get CO2 in here, otherwise it's gonna fall out. Unless we let them in a different way. Could squeeze a liquid lock in here. Or here. Even though this is all kind of in the way. Or we could fill the whole room with CO2. 
That's another way to do it. I think that would probably take a lot longer. Mm. Probably take a lot longer. Oh, and I gotta check what Nosh Sprouts like to uh, eat as well. Any, they like to eat domesticated irrigation ethanol. Oh, okay. You know what? We're gonna do them on this planet instead, I think. I think we got some Weez warts. Yep. And we got CO2. And, oh, you know what? We could do them right in here. We could do them right in here. There's some radiation from these Weez warts already. This will work nicely. I think this will work nicely. Hydroponic farm. We'll just have to get the mutant seeds over. Once these are done. So we'll do this here. Put some here. Put some there. And we'll pump some of this delicious ethanol over. Because why not? We already have an ethanol pump. It's down here. We should just use this pipeline instead, maybe. Just need to steal a little bit out of here. Keep it cool. Actually, this is closer. I might use this instead. Okay. Radiation. I don't want to hear about you anymore. <laughs> I guess we'll just keep growing these guys. That's no harm right now. What's temperature like here? 7.5. We could do some mealwood in here. Um, maybe. Or some mushrooms down here. What temperature do mushrooms like? What temperature do mushrooms like? We have one growing here. We can look here. 5 to 35. Hmm. Could grow some in the bottom here. We just have to move these radiation lamps down a little bit. Uh, temperature outside is 7. I think let's put some farm tiles here. We're, we'll do some mealwood here. We'll do a similar setup down here. And the radiation lamp pointing that way. Could do some mushrooms here. The CO2 should eventually fill up in here, maybe. If not, we'll pump some in. Okay, but first of all, right down here. We gotta put the suit checkpoint in, or this thing's not gonna work. Still don't have quite enough oxygen there. To, to power this thing on. We won't need to send oxygen out here anymore, though. So let's get rid of those vents. Oh, that one we might want to keep. This vent and that vent. Those aren't going anywhere anymore. Okay. Wrong element damage. Oh, crap. Oh, yeah, I'm not filtering out pure oxygen all the time. <clears throat> there must be some other stuff in here. Carbon dioxide. That's unfortunate. Let's keep the dupes out of here. There should... No reason for them to go in there. Okay, let's put the dock in. Stations... Yeah, let's see checkpoints. Gold, sure. Got 
some glass. Probably use some more solar panels here. Maybe over this side, make a separate circuit. Okay, let's send them in here, test this out. Should be good. Open this door. Bert, come on out. Prove that you're good. Yes, there we go. Okay, that oxygen is dedicated to that. Good, 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 perfect. So I think we're all good now. Oh, the rocket. Did I forget about the rocket. I did. <laughs> is this dupe still alive? Barely. Get the suit on. We can click on it. Oh, that's a worn ammo suit. Oh, well. I'm gonna land anyway. And you're gonna get a little bit crispy. that thing. Get out of here. It's gonna get scalded. Oh, he didn't. Amazing. <laughs> okay, I think we have everyone on a planet now. All the rockets are landed. Now all we need to do is force the dupes to do some kind of job. For 10 cycles in a row, and they should get this achievement. So we'll test this out. I'll give them some, uh, some big dig orders or something. Dig and supply orders and see if that works. But first, let's put uh, some mushrooms in here. And the radiation lamp thingy right here. I'm gonna turn these radiation radiation lamps off. In fact, I'm gonna deconstruct them for now. Actually, we can just disable them. Disable those. We don't need to mutate mutate those plants anymore. These ones we do want to. Now it's going to get too cold in here for these to grow at some point. Maybe, depending on the uh, temperature of the slime we bring in. I think as, as long as they're not idle and they have stuff to do, we should get through this uh, quest here. Let's make sure there's always something for them to do. Like sweeping. Sweep all this crap up. Make sure we don't sweep up the infinite storage. Sweep it all up. This should keep them busy for a very long time. Okay, we're gonna sweep up that. Make sure we don't have any idle dupes on Redani. Still getting weird. Oh, there goes our oxygen. What happened? What happened? Oh, the suits are full. No? <clears throat> what the heck happened? What the heck happened? Oh, there it goes. Strange. Did the water stop? Oh. Hmm. I don't know what happened there. But we'll give a similar, I don't know if I, yeah, I have an infinite storage here, so let's do some sweeping on this planet as well. Keep them busy here. Gotta keep them all busy for 10 cycles. Let's check the achievement first, see how it's going. Job suitability. Dupes who completed exosuit errands this cycle, 7 of 32.
we'll check at the end of the cycle. Hopefully we they all got something to do. They're all picking up stuff and delivering stuff on all planets, hopefully. Oh, we got three idle here. How is that possible? Did they sweep everything already? Hmm. What's going on here? Three idle. We are on a coffee break. We should all have a sweep order. Idle three. Well, we'll give them some dig orders as well. Oh, there's something growing there. We'll leave that. They should all be able to sweep, though. This is really strange. Oh, that's idle on a different, different map. Okay. That explains it. Okay, we'll get them stuff to do here as well. Sweeps. Lots of sweeps. Uh, I'll give them some digging as well. Keep them all busy. Uh, let's mop this up. Actually, yeah, that's fine. Mop that up. Still three idle. Different map again. Okay. Okay, their suits are missing. Atmo suit zero. Where did the suits go? They're stuck here. Where's our one dupe? <laughs> our one good dupe. Okay, we'll disable the checkpoint for now. So they can go get some suits. Oh, they're all trapped in there. Okay. Well, hopefully they can all get suits. Get those delivered. Okay, we got three suits. Um... We'll put the suit repair in in here, I think, as well. Well, let's enable that again. Okay. Got one Atmos suit there and three on the rack. Okay, that should be good. Where the heck is the Atmos suit fixer? I don't think I have one in here. Oh, here it is. Worn Atmos suits um, forever. As long as we got uh, reed fiber, we're good. We'll do it for all of them, in case we get some other types. Priority 9. And we'll make a few spare ones. Um, <laughs> cobalt? No. Aluminum? Maybe not. <laughs> Need some refined metal. I got rid of my rock crusher. We'll put it back over here, I think. Right there. We can refine some aluminum there. Okay, no one's idle. That's good. No one's idle. And no one's idle. Keep them busy. We gotta keep them busy for 10 cycles. I think that should be easy. Let's give them loads of work to do. I think we'll have this one in the back. Maybe. It's a good opportunity to clean everything up as well. Because that's been a, a pain. These guys are not getting any slime. Rene is allowed in here. 
There they go. What are they doing? Should be able to get the slime in here. Make these priority nine. Adam. Gonna make this all one for now. Oh, dropped. Who has dropped themselves? Okay, I've ran out of suits again. I don't know how this happens. Is there some other suit dock? Oh yeah, there's suit docks down here. <laughs> I gotta get rid of. Okay, um, deliver suit. Don't think there's any available. Get rid of these. Make sure they don't go in down here without a suit. Because that would be bad. Trapped? Not really trapped. You're just chilling. Okay, now we can get those suits up there real quick. The icon's not changing when I do this. Not sure why. delivered. What the hell is going on? What a weird sound I'm hearing. Oh, I have suits up here as well. No, I don't. Okay. What is happening? <laughs> The actual F is happening. <laughs> uh, is there some other way for them to get out? No. There's a suit here to be to be used. This is priority nine. Go get the suit, buddy. Oh, I see something wrong with these guys. <laughs> Drowning. Okay, uh, please deliver these suits. Come on, you guys can do it. I know there's a suit there. It's right there. You can get it. Oh, they're almost out of food. Oh, something's just massively messed up here. Massively messed up. What on earth? Well, we're out of food. That's one thing. Um, I, don't, I don't know where all the food went all of a sudden, but um, that's another thing. Jeez. Oh, we're going to stop sending Sleet Wheat to the other map. Put uh, Frost Buns back on the menu. As one thing to help preserve the food, stop that. Gotta fix this suit issue though. Oh, they're sleeping in here! Oh my god. <laughs> That's the problem. That explains it perfectly. <laughs> Well, not the weird sound that's going on, though. Go sleep up here, guys. There we go. Okay, that explains it. That explains it. Okay. 
Just my own stupidity again. Um, I think we're going to make a few spare suits here. Assuming we can. We're going to make five of these, four of these, just in case. Okay. I don't see any idle dupes anywhere. That'll be the, the main test here. And we were going to set up some ethanol here for these guys. Someone has planted bog bucket here. I think a little pip has been... I don't know what that is. I don't know what that sound is. I think something's on emergency. Yeah, let's get these bog buckets back out of here. That's gonna drive me literally bonkers. Where is it? <laughs> Maybe it's on a different planet? Five idle. No. We don't want any idle dupes. Okay, we're gonna do the stupid, uh... Stupid thing here. Uh, allow all copy settings. That's not gonna keep them busy very long, though. We're gonna fill this up in no time. I wonder if running on a wheel is considered an errand. I wonder. We can find out here. Plus they could all use a little exercise. We didn't put our exercise exercise room back last time. Might as well put that on the backbone, if they're going to generate the power. Get some heavy lag here. Okay. Let's slow things down a bit here. Let's see if this weird sound is still going on here. available. Okay, that's odd considering. Oh. Okay, they're gonna fill in those docks. Okay, that makes sense. Maybe. Come on, game. Make me happy. No, I'm still hearing that weird sound. I think I have some kind of emergency priority on something that I can't see. And I don't know where it is. Farm plot inoperable. No! Game! Stop! <laughs> Stop whatever you're doing. There's something on this planet that's doing it. <laughs> what is it? What is it? I don't know what it is. <laughs> Super annoying though. We are gonna run, run out of food here though, so let's make sure these are high priority. Some bog buckets growing here. You know what, let's do some more bog buckets. Oh, that's gonna drive me completely bananas. Good thing the episode is going to end soon, because that's going to drive me nuts. I don't know what it is. I can't tell. Can't tell. It's it's definitely on that planet, because it doesn't happen here. Oh, it does happen here. Okay. They did do a patch recently. Maybe there's something weird in the game that's causing this. It's probably something I did, but... But I don't know where it is. 
Don't know where it is. Okay, let's check that achievement. Um, job suitability. 19 of 32. Exosuit errands. I don't think running on the wheel is considered an errand. So maybe this was a bad idea. They should be doing other stuff first. Some of them can't dig. All of them should be able to deliver. Not all of them can build. Thing's still going on. <laughs> I'm gonna cancel every order on the map and hopefully this thing will go away. Please go away. Please stop. Please stop. <laughs> doing the reverse of what we want, but... Usually that sound is when an emergency order has ended. I just don't know where it is. Maybe it's on Radani. I guess I could have searched for it this way. That would have been smarter. We're looking for emergency work orders. Maybe it's attached to one of the suits somehow. That would explain it, maybe. It seems to have stopped. I think it's on the suit. I think I maybe put the pickup order on these suits. No. Who knows? Who knows what's going on? I think I am going to let the game run a little bit off camera just to see the sweep order and try to figure out what the hell's going on. But I gotta wrap things up here. Now we at least have all the exosuit docks in the right places. So as long as we give them something to do that they can all do for 10 cycles in a row, we should be able to get this achievement out of the way. Seven of 32. Maybe I'll have to give them something to build. Give them giant build, dig, <clears throat> um, build, dig, and supply orders. No one should be idle. Maybe they're doing non-job jobs. <laughs> don't see any idle dupes though. So that job suitability thing should be good. As long as no one's on a schedule that's a lazy schedule. Anyway, I'll try to figure it out. Hope you guys enjoyed that one though. Sorry about the weird sounds. I'm going to reload the game and see if that helps as well. But we're going to wrap it up there and try to figure out what the hell is going on. So, as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.